We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it free. Careful, lad. Ah! Why are these things so bad? I see we're already off to a lively stop. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here, against Odin, and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have come that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. You never asked mom about what she used to do. What did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. Did you see that over there? I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know, it is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Trade Mars Brassard, father of a few dwarves he may be well familiar with. Brock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open.
that's dirty enough to climb? Aye. Good old dwarven craftsmanship. <gasps> Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. There's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Come on there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Oh wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartalfon? Aye, lad. 
Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Think we can fit under that bridge? Find anything good up there? those geysers? Hmm. hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach.
Okay, we froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? Dwarven ingenuity for ya. Back to the boat. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be... Quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke. Especially where gods are concerned. This place is wrecked. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Nista.
Good thing you learned the runes, brother. I think that's everything here. Want to get going? Just, I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavalir. Hey, father, up there. Right there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. Cover that geyser from here. Oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. coming down. Is there something else we can hit? Nice one. Can you 
See anything from that block? That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. You think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellia, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh, they're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body, and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. How's that for us, though? They are scared. Was definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Could we talk we to you for... We don't want any trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. Hmm? Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Or fear him. One less feathery spy. Sentry! Hello! I return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something. <laughs> Take your time. Thanks for grabbing that for us. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oof, you are long overdue for our replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it? What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things. Oh, in 
in action. Ah. Whew. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say, Ski Alpha. Ski Alpha. Ski Alpha. Ah! Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a leader. How was I supposed to know they were there? Ski Alpha! <laughs> Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. At your service. So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever have one. What can I make for you? Hey, what happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. Huh, that might be my best piece yet today. Gonna keep it spatter-free this time, right? Kratos? I'll disinfect my tools. Be safe! Another of Cavassia's poems. Best of luck. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, everyone's hiding on this side too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking on some doors for direction. Hmm. <laughs> Let's just keep moving. A firebomb! from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp witch she had until she turned to... Ah! <laughs> 
Could you maybe? No! Thank you. Excuse me, but we're looking Nothing for... for you here. I don't care what you want. No food, no encouraging words. No nothing. Please! This looks promising, right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Good yeah, point though. Think that's him? Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there, and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. But he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off. Come. A 
the boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Daryl was some sort of rebellion leader. It doesn't sound like anyone's following you. Was being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Derlin's. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, uh, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. So we're going to Durland's? Makes sense. We could always explore those mining rigs later. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. We're looking for Derlin? You have an appointment? Uh, no? Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> here to collect on something, pal. I think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is going to scare me into somehow approving Astrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <gasps> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get... Huh? You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Faye is dead. Rest of them are. One's left alive after pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin. And free Svartalfine from the Aesir. 
Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Right, before you go. Take this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the all father's given name and, uh, yeah, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? <laughs> oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Hey, this isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Watch your left! <laughs> <laughs> directions the dwarf has given us a map sort of uh you smell them but it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain ah tears helped us anyway not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight
This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. I should say. Into his head. He burned that into Derlin's head? Failed rebellions tend to warrant swift and enduring retribution. He is a captain of Odin. Aye, and the bearer of Galahorn. A true believer, that one. There are few things so dangerous in a man as lack of doubt. Seems like we're here. Come on. This way, I can see another train. Let's look for a way to get over there. You know, maybe finding Tyr is our best protection. Seemed like Odin really didn't want us to find it. Once Tyr's free and can be God of War again, Odin won't have time to worry about us. If that is his war to fight, he may have it. I think I see something. Whoa, is that a Trekkie? What happened here? Use caution. I think it's dead. Yep, definitely dead. Hey, I wonder if... Atreus! The oh, no, no, no! <laughs> 
Drekius were killed the first one we found? If so, it was their aggression that got them both killed. Down there, I can see a mine. That has to be what Derlin was talking about. Tracks up on the left there. Might be another train we can take. Father, what if a war with Odin isn't just tears to fight? What if it's ours too? War is not the only way. We're gods. Better gods. We're trying to stop Ragnarok, to help people. And what if the only way to do that is war? Atreus. <laughs> <sighs> Forge ahead. Unintended, I imagine.
we have to get this one back on the track. Wow, this thing is small. Okay, we need to go left. Wait, I meant my life. Keep going. We're so close, just a little to the left. That's way too far. Namir, tell him left. We're so close, just a little to the left. Yeah, that's it. Round two, here we go. The Kraken Hatchling gave you a stone. Oh, uh, Diener. Yeah, covered in algae. I was thinking we could show it to Brock and Sindri when we got back. Here. Okay, so, we came here looking for Tyr because we don't trust Odin, right? If you think about it, or could... Uh-oh. Stop! 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 Stop!
Whetstone of the Night Ripper. When resisting an occupation, sometimes the most obvious methods are the best. It is old. No longer of use. But enough about you. I'm talking about the Whetstone. This place is incredible. <laughs> mouth you had on the train, lad. It's just a word. I've heard way worse from... The word does not matter. You lost control. We were falling through the air. I thought we were gonna die. Is that what you truly wish your last word to be? No. In moments of crisis, panic does nothing. Harness it. Let it serve you. must lead into the mine. We'll need to get past this cargo. Oh! Hey, looks like the water powers the crane that's keeping the cargo up. That's it. Let's head across. Another Nornir chest. Aye, but no seals to destroy or bells to ring. These are different. <laughs> Good bet there's a couple more near here. Let's find them, yeah? Cooperative in large scare quotes. Oh! <laughs> 
I might be able to get up there if you help me. <laughs> Great. I'll head across for a better look. Father, there's a gate up here heading towards the entrance to the mine. If you can get up here, I'll need your help lifting it. If. That was close. Try again. Oh, come on. You can jump that. Your knees aren't that bad. Atreus. Whoa! I hope you can make that jump. It's another one of those wooden troughs. I wonder how the dwarves thought of stuff like this. Aye, might be the great motivator of convenience. Why do the work when you can get the wet stuff to do it for you? I hope Tears here. Atreus, we seek information. I know. Stop acting like I'm trying to start a war. Yet you do not say otherwise. Others? Maybe we can lay this to rest a bit, eh? Side. I will lift on mine. <laughs> Heavier than I thought. <clears throat> Thanks. Let's keep moving. Looks like we found Jarlin's mine entrance. Got something else for you. Sindri! What is it? Since you're currently lacking a light source, sorry, and have no way of seeing exactly what untold horrors lurk in the dark, these will help. Okay, back to your exploring now. Off with you. Thanks, Sindri. Hey, wait, what do you mean by... Untold horrors. Oh, my God. 
Huge cranes moving this way. Stay there. Yes, sir. Darlin might have been as well oiled as this crane. I don't believe he'd lead us astray. You think the lad's too trusting? He is eager to prove himself. It clouds his judgment. Oh, I know you have more faith in him than that. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Gvasia. the mine. Intriguing. However, we're ill-equipped to do anything with it right now. Look out! Well, looks like the official entrance to the mine is blocked. But there's got to be another way. Maybe this cave will get us in. This way. Nice. Not a dead end. Come on, let's see where this goes. You <laughs> guys again? <laughs> Certainly smells like we're headed into a mine. I think I can hear the water too. Slow down, Atreus. Take care. Be ready. So, I think I found where those wrecks were coming from. They will overwhelm you quickly. Stay close. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. Well, hurry, it will be so. Right side, yeah. brother. Ah! 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 She's dead. That'll take care of the rest of these things. That's all of them. Ah, the smell these things leave behind is so gross. A small consequence for disturbing the home. Let's keep moving. Jump. Maybe we can ride this boat thing further into the mine. Worth a shot. I don't think we're gonna be able to get in any other way. Sorry. I know you said not to, but I can't stop thinking about this. We spend all of our time fighting bad stuff, and I don't get why we can't do that alongside Tyr. We do not know him. We saw his shrines. He's a leader. He stood up to Odin when no one else would. If he's done it before, why wouldn't he do it again? Images from long ago do not tell a whole story. There's a the door. Once we get off this, let's check there for Tyr. It's gotta be close. I can't help but feel like you're angry with me or something. Ever since we got to Svartalfine, you've been critical of my every move. If you don't think I can lead us, just say so. It is not your competence that is in question. Okay, but what does that mean? Consider your intent. This place is huge. Must have taken ages to build. Another door. We'll have to check that one too. Sure, its instructions do not say which one. Nope, we're on our own here. Your question from before, about my intent. I intend to help the God of War stop Odin. And that means freeing him from whatever prison he's in right now. Brace yourselves, friends. Sindri? Oh. And be careful exiting that thing. One foot at a time, there are loose, rusty nails everywhere. Have you seen any signs of tear? As if I would navigate this maze of running sewage. No, I'm sure you'll manage that on your own. I don't know. The water looks pretty clear here. Keyword, Lux. Whatever you need. Fire's actually a disinfectant, so these are very hygienic. I'll heat up the forge. with pride. 
I'll take him. Take care of your armor, and it'll take care of you. Look, there's a door just across this gap. Tear could be right there. <laughs> Whoever wrote this certainly had an eye for detail. The water flows blocked. Get off us! Sounds like you got the water moving along, brother. What next? That worked. Let's get to the door. Come on. Well, I certainly don't think this is where Tyr currently is. He, he's got to be here somewhere. This mine is huge. Atreus, what do you intend to stop Odin from doing? You speak as if you know his plan. I don't know his plan. That's why we're... Ahem. Brothers, with Thimblewinter underway and Ragnarok around the corner, Odin will be desperate. Whatever he's planning to do surely won't be to the benefit of anyone but himself. Exactly. Across the way, there's another door. Maybe that's the one. are there down here? Not to be discouraging, but it is a mine after all. Namir, that is discouraging. Uh, did you see that over there? There's a broken door up to the left behind this crane. Maybe Tyr tried to escape. We should look. Turn. There's another door! Beat these guys and check there! Find you! 
Shall we? Hmm. Wonder where this leads. I think we can go this way. A statue. Made for the Aesir. Indeed. And then stolen by Ulf, Yulf the thief. Anything illuminating. Hmm? Huh. Glad we explored.
Come on, let's take that lift up. Tier can't be far. Flowing water is burning the train. Clever. We'll be up there in no time. Probably feeling locked up in this mine. If I were imprisoned by Odin and finally freed, Odin would obviously be at the top of my list. But I would just want to fight something. Anything. Even if it was just to know I still could. Happened here. Stretch, left flank. Stretches. Certainly weren't here. Best look around. This dwarf didn't make it out. Is that a relic? Huh.
another empty vault. Ahem. <clears throat> Little brother. Perhaps it's time no, we... No, don't even say it. We're gonna find him. <clears throat> Look, another door on the other side of the cavern. Let's go. Beautiful. We're above where we got off the boat by Sindri. This mine is one enormous spiral. Didn't that work? The chain is blocked. Jump. Should be clear now. Ready when you are. I think I can hear something in there. A statue. Not just any statue. That stony visage hung over the entrance to the World Mill, built by Durin the Generous. What is wrong, the holes? We've got to clear out all these undead oh! One more door. That one has to be it. We will see. Seems like we'll have to get to it first. Climb across. Look for another way. I think I see a crank over here. We've used water Atreus, to power the... another mental exercise. Would one who spends their life fighting, such as Tyr, have any desire to prove themselves? Proof leads a wake of destruction. But if the wake of destruction is a bunch of bad guys, why does that matter? You're strong, and you did the right thing. War does not measure the strength of a man. I hope one day you understand.
Well, that didn't quite work. Something else we can do? We still have to go back and check out that last door, right? This looks familiar. We're back in the spiral section of the mine. Do you hear that, brothers? I don't think we're alone. Ears open. Eyes up. It came from over here. There's a passage leading out. Fine, I get it. Brothers! Wait, is that light up ahead there? Hey, this might be it. That door's barred. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't lock a door like that to secure the spare bed clothes. I see what we must do. Get up! Incoming! Oh. Uh. 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 
Clearly they don't want us in there. This has to be it. Back to it then. Is this Odin? What game do you play with me now? We're not with Odin. We're the good guys. Stay away. Rather, let me try. Tiar. Tiar. Look, you know me, don't you? You. You killed Mimir. No. No, 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 no. Yeah, we, we brought him right back. Yeah. Stay away from me, you monsters. Stop. We need him. Wait. Ah! <laughs> 
your son. Tear, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe, I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't belong out here, please. It's worse when he's angry. Father! Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You? Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants. We're returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? you in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. But... Okay. I 
I, uh, I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's, uh, there's no shame in that, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. We must return home. Can you feel that? A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by which I should call you? I'm Atreus. You already know Amir. And that's my father, Kratos. How does the son of the Spartan come to speak for the Yonar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufe? Laufe. I remember that name. She tried to help people, too. She's in the light of Valfine now. You have my sympathies. sitting down. Please, let me get that. It's the least I can do. Whoa. Why risk Odin's wrath to free me? Well, Ragnarok is coming. I hope you knew that. We thought you'd want to help. You freed me only to start a war? No! Um... Um... Sotia, it's good to see you in the flesh again. Mimir, what's become of you? Following in your footsteps. Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the Old Father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Well, that. Highly pleasant. For all parties involved. Ah! You okay? The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade will make it easier on your eyes. Come on. You said Ragnarok is coming. Means Balder. Balder is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard, and then he found Kratos. At... Anyway, I'd promised to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they'd chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Amir. Speak of Balder. I was getting to that. It wasn't all kill this, kill that. Hey, we're back in the wetlands. Watch out! No, 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 no. It's okay. I've got it. Brother, that Grim's trying to pass on high! <laughs> Poison, right side. <laughs> We must leave before more creatures attack. You should have taken the spear. Defended yourself. No. I've abjured all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. If Odin starts Ragnarok, 
You really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. Before we go any further, the truth. What is it you want from me? You, you speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me, that I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war, or worse yet, lead you to it, then kill me now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tear we need. We need you. for a good night's rest and maybe some food. I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner. Brother, perhaps now you'd like to finish the story? Uh, the sons of Thor attacked us. We killed them. Baldur tried to kill Freya. I killed him. But you skipped over how he fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the Giants are all gone. And how they called me Loki. Finding the shrines the Giants and... are gone. And we got to Jotunheim. They were all... Dead. Dead? Do you think Odin... We do not know. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa. What are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ainuriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. Look out! <laughs> Yggdrasil, it's been too long. I had forgotten. The beauty. Tyr, in your travels, did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are... were... very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Treehouse. Lord Tyr, you're really alive! Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be. So, can we talk about what to do next? 
There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. Hold still! Yep. Ah, <clears throat> oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, dear. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr, sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey! Come see what I got for you! I'm sure we won't be interrupting any goings on. I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a broom closet? Yes. That's all I need. To be honest, it's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hard tack. Hard tack. Any sort of humble ship's biscuit will do. I, with a pinch of salt. Well, I'll see what I can find. Put some herd on them. You make up your mind. Damn, am I good or what? Very good. What are you thinking, brother? I am thinking. I want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to climb a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so... restless. I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His game is fresh. You expect too much. Aye, ah, perhaps. Pity Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. No. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I have to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting. An old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. 
She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So, you know where Frey is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first. And then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? 